What is up, world? <laughs> if you don't know me, my name is JJ. I play football at USC, uh, wide receiver. And I'm finna get uh, labrum surgery on my left hip, possibly the right hip tomorrow. But today we travel to Minnesota to go get the surgery done. It's like 7 45 finna head to the crib my mama there finished packing and then when the train is finna come pick us up from the house take us to the airport and then we depart to minneapolis let's go baby let's do this shit man man we finna get ready finna head to the airport we gotta go to minnesota dr chris larson gonna do it for us he uh he the head position for the minnesota twins i think but yeah, he gonna do the he gonna do the surgery procedure for us. So y'all can wait. Yeah, RDU right now. Headed into headed inside. Gonna get on the plane to Minneapolis, Minnesota. And then get the surgery done. Eastern time, but we'll be on Central when we get there. So. Minnesota, um, Minneapolis Airport, thanks on Monday, Twin City. Where we just landed, it's like 1.45 local time. So 2.45 back at the crib, but Please please call 2193 service to Never thought I ever get Minnesota in my life. Passengers should now be on board. Snowing like crazy, dude. This femur is round like a light bulb, and where it's really white here is where it's not. And you'll see it better in some of these other x-rays that I show you. But you also see you have these little fragments below this up so you can see a little better. Right here we have these extra little bone fragments that have happened from the ball kind of hitting into the socket. Mm -hmm. And then some of the labrum and capsule and area around that starts turning to bone and then once you get these little fragments up here now you can see how this trying to move up into that there's less and less mobility so the initial thing you notice is you're tight and you feel like you're having these kind of hip flexor pulls and that's probably what you know what's going on in high school you got the same thing going on over here it's just this one's more advanced in terms of what's going on with it so you are getting some wear and tear in this joint right so you're getting some early arthritis in this hip in addition to having the tight feeling. Right now, when I look at your hips, I say, okay, this hip, I want to do everything I can to try to improve your mobility, try to slow down the damage that's taking place, fix the labrum, and it could be anything from putting stitches in the labrum, and sometimes we have to put a new labrum in there. We actually take a little donor graft and put it around the edge, because I want to make your hip as normal as I can. Mm -hmm. Probably talk in a while, but we're back in the hotel. Uh, we had a little consult with Dr. Larson, and uh, now we're just gonna chill here. We're gonna go get dinner in a little bit, because I'm not supposed to be eating after nine, so I think a little something before I leave for surgery tomorrow.
Oh, we appreciate everything you guys did for us. We're done with the surgery. Now we head back to the hotel. I'm going to get some rest. <laughs> but now nah, this shit hurts. It's like six hours post-op and a lot of pain. My legs kicked up on pillows and hip hurt, but should be fine. 11 hours post-op. Legs swollen, um, still painful, but not as bad as earlier. Go past this hey, one, after. then at the next one, turn right. I'm going to physical therapy right now, more than after the surgery. Um, should be interesting. Couldn't sleep too well last night, but. Hopefully this PT helps out my hips and then we'll see what happens. Got the rest of the day off and then our plane ride at six to head back to Chapel Hill, so let's so go to PT. So we're at the airport right now. Headed back to RDU. They had to put me on a, on a wheelchair to get through the airport. Um, pain, one to 10, probably a seven and a half. I ain't even gonna lie, this shit hurt for real. But, I just gotta, gotta get through it. So. Let's get ready for this recovery process. Day one of rehab starts really tomorrow. I think it started today, but like real rehab starts tomorrow. Get back, gonna be crazy, man. Day two post op. Just been keeping the leg elevated for real, but um, pain is still about the same on the same scale, but mobility still limited. Plan out of an actual rehab tomorrow morning, so we'll see what happens.